Okay, I'm just gonna show you quickly how this works. This is the Mirage one. Like I jumped and then I get in here. This is like the starting thing. You can click which weapon you want. Like if you shoot it, like I have standard uh, block now, but let's say I want the, uh, I know, Deagle. Now I got a Deagle. Shoot the AK again. Now I got a Deagle and an AK. Can do defense practice, peak practice, pre-fire practice, smoke practice, fire practice, flash practice, practice tools. Which I'm not that sure about. This is just like sounds on or off. Showing binds or like, I don't know, binds. Friendly bots on or off. Both Kevlar and helmet or only armor. This is infinite ammo on or off. And this is show spread on or off. This is just reload map. So let's uh, just show you these real quickly. This is just uh, like you've seen what this. Uh, let's just maybe this is the first one you watch. Okay, I just clicked. Uh, the flash practice, so now it's on flash practice, and now it's it's just on this one, so this is practicing. It's bonus practice, apparently. Targets on or off. Guidelines on or off. And then this is like, if you want to do challenges, like you click like this on challenge, and then it's challenge instead of main practice. Kind of makes it fun, so it's not just boring practice, okay? And then it like shows you where to stand, and then it shows you where to aim. And then it's like, oh, look, it worked like that. And then you can turn the help on or off. So you can maybe like check better, like what works for your crosshair to aim at. And like with this one, it's easy. It's just like this door frame, you know, but also it like, it doesn't always matter that much. Like if I go on this one and I just do this, it's still going to be about the same thing. So not all of them are very precise. Some of them are very precise though, but you'll figure it out with the target and you can go next. And then it will show you like in chat. So it'll throw to the next one. It says run and throw this time instead of stand and throw, which I was standing. So I run. Boop. Sometimes it says walk. So you just hold your shift button. For me, it's alt, but you hold your shift button for that. Sometimes it says crouch. You know what that is, of course. Sometimes it says step. So you just go boop, boop. And then you can go pref. You can do the previous one if you do pref. And if you do back, you just go back here. And I jumped in, I don't know for what. Uh, same about with the fire practice, it's just mollies or incendiaries. Like here, see, you can't even really get everywhere. So because I fell, I now need to do. I don't think he did that very correctly because if people fall, then yeah. So here it's saying kind of on the corner here, you know, or maybe line up with this line. And then it says aim here. And then, okay, uh, I don't even know what it's called. Sandwich, okay. See, it. I even learn uh, what things are called at names. Like, I know that's stairs and I know that's Tetris, but I didn't know in between was sandwich. So, see, you learn callouts that way as well. And then if I turn the help off, I'm like, where do I aim? Like, is this, this little black dot must always be there and it's more black than that. So, I guess that's where people aim. Like, it mostly says you something easy to aim at. And some things I figured out what works better for me, you know, just go back, smoke practice is about the same. Uh, let's just do prev. So like we're, oh, what the hell happened here? <laughs> why, why do I have uh, a molly? I think I didn't click this then, right? Yeah. Okay. So oh, it's saying stand on here and then you aim at that. Well, let's just uh, throw this there. Help. And now I turned help off. It basically just told me to aim here, you know? And then it's a uh, stand and throw, I'm pretty sure. And there's very useful ones like for this. Boom. I know that like there's like if two people do some of them, then it's like kind of easier. And some of them I'm like, oh, this doesn't seem very helpful, but like uh, eventually it might be very helpful, you know? Like with a Molly, I know that if I. It, it doesn't even exactly say it like that, but it works much better for me. Like with a molly, I would be here and then I'd aim for the middle of this, like where it all connects, like there's a thicker thingy. And then I run and I throw and then the molly like destroys the whole of window, like in windows all fired. And with a, I know with the smoke, I just go in here, align up this thing along with 
I don't really remember. <laughs> I think it was this line. I'm not that sure. And then I stand and throw. That works good enough for me. Like, I didn't remember exactly, but, like, it smokes all of it. So that, that one is, like, super handy to me. There's mul multiple of those. Like, there's also one that's... Um, like, I think if you stand on this side and throw it somewhere, it also smokes short. So let's say somebody smokes window and the other one smokes short. It's easier for us to go, like, down here uh, and up here and then towards A or even underpass. Like, there's all sorts of things you can do in tactics. Okay, that was kind of the throwing stuff. And then uh, pre-fire practice, which I showed you the... Uh, I showed another video of it, but I'm going to just show this... Right now, it it's like shows you a line where to walk, and it just shows you where everybody could be hiding. You know, it's like oh, that's the first one. Whoa, way too far. Okay, that's another one. Then there's this one, and there was this one. And like, if you practice stuff like this, you'll get better and better. Obviously. So yeah, and it just this. Ew, ew. I'm not gonna play the whole thing though. I suck, but we know that, right? We know Smofo sucks. But I'm just showing you. Also, I'm practicing stuff, so... Not just like this, by the way. See, and I know that now, but let's see, I made the mistake, right? Because I never played this one before. I know now that if I come up here, after I check the things I checked, which I already forgot, but I will just should just pl play more of these on more maps, you know? And then I should, uh, I should check here first before I keep checking the rest, you know, like the, the next one is this one. And I was going for that one, but I forgot about that one. So the more I do this, the more I learn. Oh, I was gonna say, I think the next one is there. Ow. Fuck off. Okay, whatever. You get it, right? And then I go next. And look, now it says palace to site. And then next it says mid to be. And then next it says apps to be. And next it says underpass to be. Like it's a lot of... A lot of it just helps you check um, places where people can be. And you'll, uh, if you practice it enough, you know where the heads are, you know? Kind of, at least. Can be faster. And... Um, I don't want to make this video too long. It's already too long. Um, and like for multiple maps, you can do this, of course. And uh, depending on how the game goes and info you get and how long time it has been on the map, you can kind of sometimes be like, oh, there's no way somebody could be there. So you just ignore that one. And then you check for the next one, right? Okay. And then there's peak practice, which is Kind of like the same, I think. Oh no. Oh, Smofa sucks. Smofa sucks. There you go. Next one. This, what? Oh, now it's like the other way around. I think you can set them not to. I don't know why you would though, because then you might as well just play the other one. Now it's there. Okay. Oh, that's that. And then. Well, next to CT angle, yeah, you can do all the other stuff, right? And then there's defense practice, which I'm not even really sure what it is. 30 kills, knife, AK, one. Never played this one before. I guess just a lot of people gonna come. Not bad. Like, I know I already positioned myself badly but I think this is more about aiming anyway then whatever and you have this on uh, for all all the maps basically that are being played oh I hope this helps like to uh, if you want to practice on these type of maps